guys, welcome to the vlog. I'm here in beautiful Mexican Mountain, Utah. It is an absolutely gorgeous day. I just landed and jumped out of the airplane really quick because my buddy Troy Mason, this is his very first off airport backcountry style landing. So I brought him into Mexican Mountain, not a more beautiful location in the entire world to do your first. <laughs> here he comes. <laughs> He's high. You got this, buddy. Beautiful approach. Good job. Beautiful job, Troy. Yeah, buddy. Perfect. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sick. For your first time, that's pretty awesome, Troy. <laughs> Good job, buddy. Okay, we're down here in, at the Green River, and I landed on this little sandbar. Troy nailed Mexican Mountain. Now he's gonna do his first sandbar landing. 
I hope. I told him to go around if it didn't look absolutely perfect. It's not very soft. It's a good sandbar for your very first time. You don't want to land in really soft stuff for your first time. You can get a little hairy. Here he is on short final. Oh yeah. Nail it, Troy, buddy. Woo. Love it. So I told him to kind of land just long where, where it's still a little dark and the sand is a little wet. There you go, come down. You got this. Yeah, set her down right there. Boop, pull down. Perfect. Perfect. <laughs> oh, love it. <laughs> oh, so proud of Troy. He's crushing it. He did it! It's as easy as that, baby. <laughs> How cool. How absolutely freaking cool is this spot? Look at this. <laughs> I love the smell of ab gas. All right, here in uh, the basin of the Green River Basin, I don't know, something like that. Got the airplane parked on this little bluff and we are gonna be soon picked up by a helicopter and we're gonna camp right there, no joke. Right there. It's gonna be awesome. I'm excited. <laughs> All right, we're waiting for our ride to go up they're taking a long time, so I think they have a surprise. <laughs> and knowing Scott Palmer and Savage Sack and all those wild men, it's gonna be good. Fast that ripped open. <laughs> Sick. Oh no. Oh <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> welcome to the party. Oh, welcome to Moab. <laughs> <laughs> welcome to Moab, brother. How's it going? There's Blammer! Ah! Oh, oh, watch out for the cat! He's right there! He's sick! <laughs> What's up, bro? Good okay. to see you, man. Oh, is there, oh shoot, I missed him. Yeah, how you doing? <laughs> Good. Oh, that was oh, a good opening. Yeah, they that were all ripping. <laughs> yeah, I did. That boulder comes quick! <laughs>
So we uh, camped out on this beautiful, I don't know what to call this, cliff's edge? A rock, bra. A, a rock, rock, a rock bra. We're here with uh, Scott Palmer. Mom's house. <laughs> and Matt, or not Matt, Nick, <laughs> which you'll know him as on uh, Instagram as Savage Sack. Really cool, Just follow him. Um, Matt's not here. Matt Rosado was the guy who did the wing grab from the helicopter at High Sierra last year. Um, so below us here is the Green River. Really beautiful and down here there's a bunch of kayakers actually that... Oh, oh shadow, shadow! Oh, there! Oh, now I got sun. Anyway, there's a bunch of kayakers down there on the shoreline so very cool. It's kind of cool to share the... Uh, share nature with everybody. What a fun experience camping up here on the ledge. I landed my cub on that sandbar and then there's one down river a little bit over there that's a little bit longer and that's where Troy landed yesterday and uh, the cub is all alone about 300 feet directly below us right check this out this is so sick see him down there a little ghosty I don't know if I can see him. Where is he? Where is he? He's right there. So, yeah, you can see the little cub down there. Let's zoom in. <laughs> Here he goes. Da -da -da. The backwards zoom. So a little ghost is alone down there. It's kind of cool seeing it from this angle <laughs> on the top of this freaking cliff. And all these guys are gonna base jump off of this thing. We're maybe 300 feet up, so it's a real tight one. Um, they've got these rigs that just bah, snap open really quick. And they're doing like a two count of 300 feet. Whew, wow. <sighs> Here's your invitation. <sighs> Learn how to fly, come join us on these adventures love to have you man it doesn't get better than this guys really and if you can't i'll bring them to you as best i can do it very few people get to do this because not very many people have their pilot's license or um, have access to a helicopter or a bush plane but uh just get involved like i'm just an average ordinary dude hanging out with some awesome people. And then look at where we're at, you guys, seriously. Unbelievable. It's just perched on a rock. The, uh, the tail of the helicopter is actually overhanging a cliff. So it's just literally big enough to park the helicopter on it. Here we are. <laughs> Learn to fly, you guys. Come and play. So good. It is so good out here. Here's Scott. Oh, the places aviation can take you. What do you have to say for yourself? I don't know how I got so lucky. Pretty blessed. Right? Absolutely doodly. It's like we had no idea. Like we were just the idea was anywhere. to feel and then we were just Alright, so that was Scott Palmer. I'd like to uh, extend a thank you to Scott for inviting me out with his friends. These are mostly, these are all Scott's friends. Very cool group of people, so I appreciate him inviting me. I'm going to put a link right here to Scott's channel. Head over there and hit subscribe. He has some really cool content. He's done everything from uh, indoor skydiving. He's probably the world's finest indoor skydiver, bar none. And uh, he does all kinds of skydiving, wingsuit squirrel stuff and uh, he's also a crop duster he's done a few crop duster videos very very cool stuff and he's one of the flying cowboys he flies around with us and his uh, beautiful yellow kip fox and man oh man absolutely gorgeous boom